So right guys, I'm going to show you how to play it using the original chords I was using, which were all bar chords. But obviously, stay behind. I'm also going to show you how to use some simple open chords so you don't have to play a lot of bar chords. So we start off with the F minor 7, um, a B flat, so B flat here, and then E flat, C minor 7, okay? How do you play this chord? So for the F minor 7, you're doing a bar here on the um, 8th fret uh, with your first finger and then your second finger will go on the B string on the um, ninth fret and then your ring finger will be on the D string 10th fret. You pick from the A. So B flat, you have um, a bar chord from the 6th fret from the top from the E and then you form an E chord here so middle finger on the um, G ring finger on the A pinky on the D and you pick from the E E D G B and then to play your E flat or a D sharp whatever you want to call it you're doing a bar here on your sixth fret again from the A and then I do a mini bar with my ring, fi ring finger um, from the D, so D, um, G, and B. So just like this. Or you can play like this with my big fingers. And the last chord, C minor 7. C minor 7 is very similar to your F minor 7 chord. You just slide towards the side to the 3rd fret. Okay, that will give you a C minor chord. So those are the chords you need. And if you want to play this chord, if you have a capo and you also want to, you know, play this song in the original key, place a capo on the first fret and um, you will be using the E minor chord. And then A. D, then B minor 7, B minor, A, D, B minor 7, alright, so that's with the capo, so I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that you know how to play these chords, um, if you don't then the search google um i'll show you the b minor seven so b minor seven you're bowing from the second fret on the a string all the way down and then your second finger will be on the b string on the second fret right here and then your ring finger will be on the d string okay that will give you a b minor chord so i mean all that chords are simple e minor two finger on the second fret on the a and the d a, your second, third, um, and fourth finger will be on the um, D, G, and B, strong from the A, your D, okay, first and second finger will be on the um, G, and then the E, and then your ring finger will be on the third fret on the B, strong from the D. Yeah, so those are those are the chords. So in terms of the picking, so for the for the intro, I just like to keep it simple. So I was just thinking, should I go like this? You know, it's a bit quiet, but I, I wasn't too sure, so I just chose just picking everything. So bass, so bass, and then my picking fingers are on the for for the um, F minor chord is on the A, D, G, B. Okay, and then for the um, B flat, I just move my finger up, my thumb up. Oops, wrong chord there. Let me take off my capo. So bass still there on the E. My fingers are still on the D, G, and B. bass down now again to the A string my bass is still staying on the um on the uh, on the A 
And then when it goes to the chorus, I like to strum, so... So for my strum, I just like to do a, a palm mute to strum, so you, that's why you can't really hear all the strings. So by placing my uh, my palm just on the bridge to mute my strings. And it will be the same thing if you have your capo on. So. So there you have it. That's how you play Overdose by Marvin Records. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial, guys. Um, if you have, please don't forget to show your support by subscribing to my channel and also by um, liking and sharing my videos. Take care, guys. Bye.